It's a very windy day at Construction HQ. I wonder what they'll be building today. Oh wow, a towpath for the canal. That looks amazing. To build a towpath, they'll need paving slabs. Here comes Rocky the riverboat to deliver them. Ooh, it is windy today. Rocky loves to listen to music on his big headphones. There, now to unload the slabs. Gently there. Thanks, Rocky. Now the crew can get to work on the towpath. But the wind is picking up. Oh no! Mr. Rubble's hat. It's landed on the back of Rocky. Not to worry. Mrs. Skip can get it. She's even trying it on. Oh no! Rocky is sailing on. But he doesn't realise Mrs. Skip is still on the back. Come back, Rocky. He can't hear them because of his big headphones. What's Mrs. Skip going to do? She can't get carried off down the river. Who knows where she'll end up? They have to get Rocky's attention somehow. Watch where you're going, Mr. Rubble. Oops, Mr. Rubble hit a box. Diggly is racing ahead to try and stop Rocky. Maybe he can get his attention with this ball. Good thing Mrs. Skip has the helmet. Hmm, what's Daisy up to? She's brought the stack of slabs. I wonder what her plan is. She's hopping up on top. Hooray! She saved Mrs. Skip. She's back on dry land, safe and sound. Phew. Later on and the towpath is almost finished. Rocky is drifting past again, still listening to his music. He never knew anything was wrong. It's Diggly and Daisy doing some work on the farm. Uh-oh, clumsy Daisy has knocked over a bit of fence. It's Pablo Pig. Cheeky Pablo, he's going to escape the farm. Quick, catch him before he gets away. Go on Diggly, you can do it. Look, Carlos the calf is sneaking out too. Behind you Daisy. He's running, hurry after that calf. Now Pablo's balancing on the fence. Ouch! Belly flop. Now he's off again. Whoa! Spinning round so much has made Daisy dizzy. Oh no! Now Dylan the duck is coming out. You've got to stop them, Daisy. Look out, Daisy. Ducks can swim, but you... Oh dear. Those farm animals are really pesky. Pablo Pig is running into the wheat field. He must be hiding in here somewhere. There he is. And there's Litty Lamb too. After them, Diggly. Well done, Diggly. You caught Letty Lamb. Three more to go. That's still in the duck. Carlos the calf too. Nice work, Daisy. Now you've caught Pablo too. All the animals are back safe and sound. Well done, Diggly and Daisy. With that fence repaired, they won't escape again. Look, it's the town zoo. And there's Bandit Bus. What's he up to this time? Oh no, he's unlocking the zoo doors. <laughs> And now he's opening them. The zoo animals might escape. Oh dear, that baby lion has just got out. Hey, it's Diggly and Daisy driving along the road. And there's Tony the truck. Hi, Tony. They've all got work to do. Tony's on his way to deliver some boxes. Look, the baby lion. Tony is scared. He's running away. Diggly and Daisy wonder what he's running from. Hmm. Oh. The baby lion is still there. Diggly and Daisy are frightened. Mm. Lions can be dangerous. Oh. But 
they can't just leave him to roam free. He needs to go back to the zoo. I think Ooh. Digny has a plan. Look, a toy mouse on a string. The baby lion is chasing it. He'll follow it anywhere. Oh, I see. <laughs> Diggly and Daisy are pulling the string. They're going to use it to lead the baby lion all the way back to the zoo. Oh. Oops. Daisy's knocked the sign. Now they don't know which way the zoo is. Maybe it's this way? Oh, dear. They've gone round in a circle. Well, maybe it's this way. Oh. Maybe not. Hmm. Oh no! The baby lion has caught up! But wait, he doesn't seem so scary. He just wants to play. <laughs> there, the baby lion is back at the zoo safe and sound. Good job, Diggly and Daisy. It's the construction crew, hard at work building the foundations for a brand new building. Uh-oh, I think it's going to rain. I don't like the look of those storm clouds. Time to get cover. Wait, there's Scout. Watch out, Scout. She's skidding. Careful, Daisy. Oh dear, oh dear. Daisy accidentally hit the girders. Look out, everyone. The whole thing is falling down. Oh no. Scout is trapped down that pit with the girders on top. You have to get her out quick, guys, before the rainwater fills the pit up. I think Diggly is going to move the girders first. Wait, careful. Those girders could oh. fall on top of Scout. That was a close one. Ooh. I think CJ the cement mixer has an idea. Oh, I see. If we use cement to stick all the girders together, we can drag them out in one go. Clever. Go on, Dozer. Drag those heavy girders out of the way. Great, now the girders are gone. It's up to Diggly and Johnny to dig Scout a way out. Hurry up, guys. The water is getting deeper. You can do it. Diggly and Johnny are digging as fast as they can. Almost there. Scout can drive out now. Well done, Diggly and Johnny. You saved the day in the nick of time. And look now, the sun is coming out again. Good job, everyone. See you again next time. It's a fun, snowy day at Construction HQ. I wonder what they're building today. An ice rink? Amazing! Here's the frozen pond. To turn it into a skating rink, they need to put up the soft safety barriers. Uh-oh, Bump's moving the snow, but he's not seen Mr. Rubble. Oops, Mr. Rubble is on the ice. His wheels can't grip. He's sliding. Quick, Diggly and Daisy can move the barrier so he doesn't crash. Phew! Nice work! But now Mr. Rubble is sliding towards the market stall. Mrs. Skip has to bounce him back. Good job, Mrs. Skip! Bounce, bounce! Mr. Rubble's going back and forth like a ping pong ball. But I think Diggly has a plan. They can bounce him into this pile of snow. Daisy's bouncing him towards the snow pile. Whoosh! <laughs> is Mr. Rubble okay? Ah, uh, oh, there he is! Good job, everyone! <laughs> now the ice rink can be finished in no time. Diggly and Daisy are having fun skating on it. But what's this? Skates? <laughs> now Mr. Rubble can join in and skate too! Uh. Whoa, whoa there! Ooh. Oh. <laughs> He's got it! It's so much fun!
fun to go ice skating. <laughs> Look, it's Diggly. I think he wants to lift that big girder. There's Johnny. He has no problem lifting heavy loads. He's tall and strong. But Diggly is only little. And that girder is very heavy. Oh, Diggly can't reach high enough. Poor Diggly. Here's Dozer. He wants to cheer Diggly up. Being big and strong isn't everything. Everybody has different things they're good at. There's no need to be upset. I think Diggly has a plan. He's got a barrel. And Dozer has a plank of wood. Now Diggly's up on the roof. Dozer's put a crate of bricks on the plank. Is it a seesaw? Oh, I see. It's a catapult. They can use it to bounce bricks up onto the roof. Very clever, Diggly. Johnny is still lifting the heavy bricks up onto the roof. But look, Diggly can bounce them up easily. He's using his brain to solve a problem. Look, now Daisy wants a turn. It's so much fun using Diggly's new invention. They'll have moved all the bricks in no time. Diggly may not be the strongest or the tallest, but he can be a very big help if he tries hard. <laughs> well done, Diggly. It's the construction crew. They're finishing their work on a new tunnel. Uh-oh. What's that sound? There's been a huge explosion down the mountain. Look. Huge rolling snowballs. It's an avalanche. CJ tells the other workers to get inside the tunnel for safety. Dozer pushes Johnny in. There's no time to waste. Diggly rushes to Daisy and tells her to get into the tunnel. The two get in just in time and the snow crashes down behind them. It's really dark in the tunnel. Diggly grabs a lantern and goes to investigate the snowed in entrance. It looks too thick to dig through. Even Johnny can't dig through it. Diggly starts investigating the rest of the tunnel. He can spot something up ahead. There are some train carriages on the tracks. The tracks lead deeper into the tunnel. Diggly thinks that they can get on the train and escape out the other end of the tunnel. The construction crew have all jumped on the train. Dozer is nervous to be at the front. Johnny gives them a push and they're off. Whoa, it's like a giant roller coaster. Look at them go. Whoosh. This looks like fun. Uh-oh, there is a snow blockage that they're going to crash into. The construction crew burst through the snow. They're outside and safe. Good job, Diggly and Dozer. It's a brand new day at Construction HQ. All the vehicles are excited to get to work. I wonder what they're building today. Whoa, a pancake shop. Oh dear, Diggly doesn't look his usual happy self. I wonder what's wrong. Oh no, Diggly is sick. He can't work today, he'll have to stay home. Time to start work. The first thing to do is dig the foundations. But without Diggly, how will they dig? That's not working at all. Daisy can't dig the way Diggly does.
Maybe this bro will help. Oops! Mother's going everywhere and Daisy can't keep the drill still. This isn't working either. Oh dear, oh dear. Mm -hmm. Diggly is watching from HQ. He really wants to help, but he's still feeling sick. Here's Mrs. Skip with some medicine. That should help. Back on the building site. They still haven't dug the foundations. Oh dear. Splat! Wait, this plank of wood throws dirt into the air. Like a spade. Maybe they can use this to dig the foundations. Yes, it works! Good work, Daisy. She's found a way to dig in her own way, in no time at all. There, the Pancake Shack is finished. Aww, Daisy has brought some pancakes to Diggly to make him feel better. What a good friend. Mmm, delicious. It's a bright new day at Construction HQ. Diggly and Daisy are so excited to see what they'll build today. Oh wow, a Ferris wheel. This will be so much fun. Now they're at the fairground. The wheel is almost ready. Daisy is just lifting it up. Boing. There, it's finished. But who's going to take a ride in it first? <laughs> Hooray, Diggly is having a go. Daisy throws the switch and up Diggly goes. But uh oh, something is wrong. Oh dear, the wheel stopped. Diggly is stuck at the top. There must be a way to get him down. Daisy has an idea. Whoosh! A pillow to jump on. I don't think that's going to work. Daisy will have to think of something else. She's off again. Whoosh! Look, now Daisy is trying to pull the wheel round, but it's no good. It's stuck tight. But now she has another idea. Blocks? I wonder what Daisy is up to. Whoa! She's built steps all the way up to Diggly. Here's Mrs. Skip. Oh wow! She's got a ramp to put on top of the blocks. They can turn it into a giant slide. Whee! 
That was so much fun! Diggly is fixing the wheel controls. Good as new. The Ferris wheel is ready. But look, Diggly and Daisy just want to use it to slide down the slide. It looks like so much fun. They haven't just built one fairground ride, they've built two.